I did not expect to visit a lunar habitat when I was in Japan, but there I was at the University of Tokyo visiting Professor Jun Sato and his alien looking structure. Cause he had a very different approach to building on the moon. His proposal was to create a lightweight structure that drops into a lunar lava tube, which are these massive natural caves on the moon, which already provide that protection. And all of these elements, including the solar panels, can fold into a single system that weighed just between eight to 10 metric tons. They were able to achieve this level of structural efficiency by borrowing principles from nature and using a technique he calls sacra dimples, which can essentially control exactly where the surfaces fold without relying on hinges. And after hundreds of iterations on the placement, the shape, the depth, and the density, and the sharpness of these dimples, and with wire models and then large-scale mock-ups, they finally created a structure that snaps into shape using air pressure alone. No crane, no robots, just a very passive deployment system. Because to build on the moon, where everything has to be shipped, the method of construction is just as important as the structure itself. Full video right here.